LSU remains undefeated. LSU versus Alabama. Two storied schools, two SEC powerhouses, one lopsided rivalry. Oh, it's like having that big older brother that you can never beat up. It was six years ago the last time the Tigers went into Tuscaloosa and beat the Crimson Tide. The game of the century where LSU came out on top, 9-6. Former center T-Bob A. Beer and safety Brandon Taylor relives November 5th, 2011. It was crazy, man. It was great. It was the buildup to that game was unlike anything I'd ever experienced as a player up to that point. You had all this billing of the game of the century, and so being a part of that was incredibly special to begin with. I mean, it was one of those moments where you can't replicate those feelings. Like, I'm getting goosebumps thinking about it. It was crazy. That next day after that game, like, we didn't have, I don't think we practiced that next Monday, and that Tuesday was just light practice because we walked off that field mentally and physically drained. For this year's team, no one is giving them a shot as they are a 21-point underdog. So, what does LSU have to do to pull off what seems like the impossible? So you're going to have to do things that people aren't doing. That's how you're going to win this game. You're going to have to stop a rushing tag that seems unstoppable. And you're going to have to score on a defense. A team that's going to win this game, it's always came down to it, even when I played, before I played, and it's going to be before, after I played. Whoever calls the most turnovers is going to win this game. You know, when you get old enough and you get big enough and you can beat your older brother up, so I feel like now is the time for us to beat him up. For your Go Nation, I'm Aaron Lee.